about him. Bridget Dehan, who had 14 saves in that game against North Carolina a couple of weeks ago, and Taylor Marino, who is the best goalie in the country when it comes to stopping goals. That's what it's all about. So two terrific players in between the pipes today as we are ready to go. The ACC has been so strong in goalie play, and we get to witness two of them, two of them going at each other. 17 to 16. Maddie Howe had four. Casey Choma with three. Madison Ahern with three goals as well. Impressive grit to grind that game out. High scoring affairs, Sheehan. But no rest for the weary. They're back at it today trying to pull the upset as Maddie Howe goes lefty and is denied by Taylor Marino. Shooting about 50%. It's really hard when you're being marked up against the best defender, though. And she just is so efficient. Great save, Bridget Dehan talked about the goalies early. They each look locked in. A save on the opening possession for both Dehan and Marino. Here's Maddie Howe. Dangerous from attacking up top. Goes low, Moreno there to meet it. The thing about North Carolina is it's not just Hogan Ortega, although they might get the headline she and there are so many different players that can put it on you as Dehan makes another stop. To hurry a little bit. Five seconds to shoot. Right at the end of the shot clock, no good angle. Moreno makes a save. Battle for the ground ball. We've seen teams respond if they're not winning it at the center circle. you got to come up with defensive turnovers, goalie saves. But UNC doing both of them right now, which is why they've got the lead. Let's make it, take it right now for the Tar Heels as they reload for another. It's going to be whistled. Great cut in. Dehan comes up big. Bridget Dehan trying to halt this no this North Carolina run. Five minutes when Notre Dame jumped in front 2-0. The Irish nearing 20 minutes without a goal. Great opportunity here. Moreno makes the save, battles after it for the ground ball and wins possession. What a terrific individual effort from Taylor Moreno. That is amazing play right there by Taylor Moreno, running out that possession. That was huge. I thought that goal was actually going in from Ahern on the shot. She runs it out, gets possession going back the other way. And UNC is converted on these 8-meter opportunities. Hogue had a score earlier in the game from the 8-meter. Check that Ortega had the score from the 8 -meter. Great one-on-one -on -one defense. defense. Yeah, you just took the words out of my mouth, she. And this is a clinic from the Tar Heels defensively. Moreno makes the save. Bolak just didn't really get a clean look at it. Tried to bounce it past her. Team last year, but they're not letting. They don't want to slip by. The first step is advance in the ACCs in your conference tournament. Then they want to take it to the final game in the national championship. And so many talented teams this year in 2021. Mastriani one-on-one -on -one with Dehan almost scoops himself in their attacking third. It's been a while. More than 25 minutes without a goal. Inches away from ending that drought there. Another great save, Marino. And it's just not Notre Dame's day. North Carolina two locked in on both ends. Now Lily Callahan in goal relieves Bridget Dehan And Callahan steps up. And makes a save. Her first opportunity keeps North Carolina out of the back of the net. Just trying to gain some momentum, some confidence. Still a lot of lacrosse in front of this team. They're going to need to Great. shore up their draw game. That, that's an area that as you get advanced in the NCAA tournament, you got to make Going to take a well-deserved seat on the bench in the final four minutes. Seven saves, only four goals allowed. She's got the best goals allowed average in the entire country and she brings it even lower with that performance today. Super impressive getting hugs on the sideline. Kimber Hauer will now make an appearance. 1-0 in the season. She got switched into the Duke game. A game where Moreno did, wasn't playing her best and they opted to switch and Hauer was able to come up with some saves. 
She played in seven games. This will be her eighth game this season. Really low turnovers. It felt like every time Carolina got the possession of the ball, they just took it down right to score. Great save by Kimber Hauer coming in for the final couple of minutes. Joma rings it off the pipe, no good. Just not so long. I feel like they've always matched up, and I'm not sure if that's in NCAA time or not. But typically, you know, the Big Ten ACC teams will match up against each other, and you just can tell who's beaten who to kind of make those comparisons. Well, Notre Dame started with a 2 0 lead. North Carolina over the next 47 minutes went on a monster 18-0 run. A dominant effort from the top-seeded Tar Heels and they leave no doubt in this semifinal, winning it 18-4. After a quick start by Notre Dame, this Carolina team just, they put their pedal to the metal. Beautiful job end to end, showing why they're the number one team in the nation, the number one team in the ACC. Jamie Ortega outscored the Irish by herself. Six goals for the senior, only four for Notre Dame. So North Carolina puts their spot in the ACC championship. Present